then had to find a taxi to take us to the city centre. We decided to wait till the feeding frenzy was over. We then found a friendly taxi driver who insisted that he knew just the place for us. We naively went with him. Okay, we're going to get a taxi. He thinks it's going to be about 140 and we've got a hotel, so we're on our way. What Rob forgot to mention was that it was his first day on the job and he couldn't speak a word of English. I felt we were in serious trouble. <laughs> Well, folks, we're here at the hotel. Is that what you call it? We're just giving you a quick nightcap of where we're staying. Uh, we just obviously you can see a bit about the taxi driver took us. He just didn't know where he was. He stopped three times to ask someone, but he charges 150 odd. What is it? Hong Kong dollar? I don't know what it is. It's just we haven't got a clue. We're tired. Eight quid. It was about eight pound in British money. Anyway, we've checked in. We registered here for three nights. It cost us about 600 which is probably about 30 quid but uh, it's very dark in here, I know you can't see a lot, we'll show you around in the morning because I know you'll want to uh, Barry's looking for somewhere to stay already so that gives you a bit of an idea We're not staying here then right? Yeah, well, I know you can't see much, I want to show it here in the morning I just want you to know that we've made it probably not one of our bestest of times obviously you can see it's quite loud out there this is what we're going to have to put up with uh, I don't know why, in God's name, we've got two rooms here. And if you look over here, another two rooms. We did not ask for that, but we're only paying cheap anyway. So, that's that. This is the bathroom. Best said about that. And uh, I'll leave it to your own imagination. Anyway, that's it. That's where we are. We've got to get on with it now. We're only going to be here for a couple of nights, so that's it. I don't think our diary needs to be done tonight because it's pretty self-explanatory. We've left Hong Kong. We've come to this shit pit. Anyway, we should be able to sleep well. Not? What do you think? Well, on that note, that's it. So, good night, and we'll see you in the morning. Monday and we're not really 
pleasant today. We're in a uh, not very good mood. We didn't sleep much last night because there's crashing and banging everywhere. I know uh, you didn't get to see the place, but take a look at it now. Obviously you can see it's nothing at all like what the brochure showed us. Let's see this. This is, the, this is what we were given in the actual airport to see what our hotel would look like. And uh, as you can see from all the rooms, the conference rooms, the bathrooms, take a good look at that one. And the bedrooms, it's absolutely nothing. Nothing at all to what we thought that we were going to have. I mean, I know we're on a budget and, and whatnot, but this is this is not what we want really. It's not even clean. I mean, we, we, we try to sleep in here. We, we tried to sleep in here last night, but Valley just couldn't sleep with the crash and the banging and the knocking on the doors and the telephones going off. None of the instruments work. So we slept in the other room. Obviously we've got to be careful where we put our stuff today, so we're going to have a look around. There you go. The joys of travelling. There's the view if you're interested. I don't think we are. We could do a reminder. There you go, Jan. What do you think? This is the other room. This is the one that we stayed in last night. We slept in our sleeping bags. I'm probably thinking that's a wise move. Over here is, yes, believe it or not, the bathroom. Morning, looking a bit rough today, aren't we? And that's it with all the lights on. Unfortunately, it's a bit dark. The toilet, which we won't talk about. The shower from hell. Cold water. No toilet roll. And that's it. I don't think you need to see any more. So we've decided today that we're going to look for another hotel. We've booked three nights here. We probably might do one more. We don't want to, but we probably might because we don't know the scale of the map. So right now we're just going to try and see if we get something to eat and look for another hotel. And that's it. Hotel Jobby Jobby. Any last thoughts? Speechless. After refusing to eat a breakfast of cold fish and noodles, we headed into the city hoping to find something we could stomach to start our day with. We eventually settled for a McDonald's. So Barry, this is your first meal, is it? Yeah, like as usual, it comes from McDonald's. There's not hardly a word of English. We walked down the street, we walked down a few streets this morning, took about half an hour, and we haven't seen one Western person. No one speaks English. So, this is like the sh big shopping mall in Beijing. We're going to look for a nice hotel down the road. If you get there and eat here, we should be okay. It's quite. It's quite an area. Get the keys, get the keys, get the keys. <laughs> We're in McDonald's and we're just laughing hysterically now because we're losing the plot. Hopefully, you know, we're going to find some accommodation, but we don't know anyone here. There's not one Westerner even in McDonald's. <laughs> There's not one Westerner. Look around. There's nobody. Nothing at all. And it's 12 o'clock. But we're going to have a progressive day today, I'm sure we are. So just hold on and bear with us.